Hello everyone, we are back with the chickens. Uh, I just finished mowing the grass actually. Uh, nothing too special. Looks much nicer. Uh, maybe it's a little hard to see because it's not really coming in in all places. But, but I know it's not, not very much there. But over there, you can see. Uh, a little tint of green, and that's because about a week or two, not a week, about two or three weeks ago now, I threw a bunch of seed everywhere in here, and what was happening was the chickens, I thought, were eating a lot of it. Uh, the temperature was, it was still, some nights were getting down to 30 or 40, so it wasn't really that great. Now, it's been consistent 80s-ish. Yeah, that bird's having some trouble over there. <laughs> That's gone. It's gone. Uh, we put some bird feeders up. Uh, anyway, oh, it's back. We put some bird feeders up and the birds really love it. But anyway, I threw a bunch of grass seed down. Temperature wasn't that great. Now it's been consistent 80s lately. So, so now it's starting to sprout. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to Wanna come up? Hi. This is the sick one. She has a big, uh, big problem here. Big problem, young lady. Big problem. But she seems to be doing okay otherwise, weight-wise, I guess. Uh, anyway, I keep getting off track here. The grass is starting to... Shh. The grass. The grass is starting to grow. And what I'm going to do is, when they go to sleep tonight, I'm going to throw more grass seed down. I think the reality is they eat quite a bit of it, but some of it does grow. So, uh, that's good. <laughs> I'll take what I could get. Hopefully it fills in some places. I realize this whole place is not going to look like the front yard. It's not going to be totally lush and green. But some grass would be nice for sure. I think they would enjoy it. Uh, I would enjoy it, maybe, uh, and uh, I think it'll look nicer in here, uh, but again, I think the reality is a lot of the grass is going to be killed off by them, so we'll see what happens. Not too optimistic, but if you're not expecting the best, then you can't be disappointed, right? Thanos. Thanos said that. Thanos said that? Someone in that movie said that. Guardians of... Uh, uh, Avengers Infinity War. Someone in that movie said that. I don't remember who. But if you haven't seen it, it's a good movie. Very entertaining, right? I wish I brought the chickens with me to see it. They would have enjoyed it. They would appreciate Thanos' determination. Um... Other than that, I think soon, like two weeks, two to three weeks, I'm going to put the baby chickens out here. I need to do an update video on them. They're getting quite big now. They're starting to feather up. And uh, very energetic, starting to feather up. I think in two weeks they'll be ready to come out here and party. And party with the big chickens. So we'll see what happens. I, uh, I'll buy a new water. Oh, not, not a new one, but another water. Not to replace this one, but I want two waterers and two feeders. And I think that'll be good. I don't want them competing for food and water because the big ones are obviously going to win. So. If I get two, I think I could avoid that. Just kind of spread them out, you know. And then... Should be good to go. Hopefully Judy teaches them the way of the chicken. Are you going to be a mentor, Judy? Are you going to teach them? Probably not. I'm not sure if it's even Judy. Uh, it is Judy. Judy, are you going to teach them? I don't think so. Judy's going to steal all the food for herself. 
So anyway, that about does it. I want to eat this bug off my thumb. I want to eat this bug off my thumb here. That's a yes. No, she didn't eat it. Okay. <laughs> Just want to do a little update. Uh, the garden's still coming in nice. We still have to plant the... We're going to plant the cucumbers there in that whole box. It's just going to be cucumbers. Because um, I, I really like cucumbers and they produce really well. So I think I think the idea this this season was it would be nice to grow cantaloupe. It would have been nice to grow watermelon, but we didn't really have success with them. So the plan was that we would grow things that we knew we would have success with, uh, even if it meant a more simple garden. And I think that'll work out well. What do you think? What do you think, Judy? I think my chickens are pretty hot in this weather. They always have their mouths open. I have a little pool for them. <laughs> but they don't really use it, I don't think. Like, I pick them up and throw them in sometimes, but... I don't know. Maybe they use it when I'm not looking. I never really thought of chickens as aquatic animals, so... Maybe that's one problem. You can see here they're destroying my grass. Judy, you're destroying my grass. She doesn't care. Should we show me exit? We have today. Let's see, let's see. Drum roll. Oh, here's some. That's kind of odd that it's colored like this, right? This is dirt. Oh. Uh oh. Gotta throw that one out. Gotta throw that one out. Sometimes they have holes in them. Uh, usually they're pretty good, though. All of, them, all of them are good except that one. Yes, sir. I gotta change the coop bedding tomorrow. That's a little stinky. I think I think there's a difference between between when you have to lay your or not when you have to change your coop bedding and when you should. Like I try to change it. Ah, stop. I try to change it when. It gets stinky. I'm not sure how much it bothers the chickens, but uh, I would imagine if it smells bad to me, it smells bad to the chickens. So, yeah, look at that mouth. She's so excited. Wanna say goodbye, Judy? Wanna say goodbye? Goodbye. We're running out of time here. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. Bye. Uh oh they have penetrated the egg we can't let them do that <laughs> thank you for watching and i'll see you next time say goodbye judy bye you can't have this egg judy